Welcome to this video on slip lamp examination. Today we are going to show you a lesion of the conjunctiva in which you are going to see this pigmented lesion over here and uh, it's present at the limbus. The other thing which is very prominent that it is not markedly elevated and the other thing which is present is there are some cyst cystic spaces present over here clear cystic places present in this lesion. So if something which is flat does not have any raised areas and which is recently shown growth is most probably a patient of conjunctival nevus. And this is here we want to show you a sort of detailed examination. The only thing which is uh, looking slightly abnormal or which is not very uh, significant uh, very normal in these is these feeder vessels which are coming in and uh, the, this, these cystic spaces are definitely present over here and the other thing which you will see as we go forward that the patient does have a bit of telangiectatic vessels on top of this area here you can see some telangiectatic vessels over in this area the telangiectatic vessels are present so this is slightly unusual for this patient otherwise he is a patient typically with a slowly enlarging growth which is present at the limbus and this is a conjunctival nevus usually it increases in size at puberty or with the hormonal changes in the body and the treatment of choice in these patients is to go in and excise the lesion and reconstruct that area after going for a biopsy. So the main, the main thing which you do is do a biopsy for these patients so that you can get a histological diagnosis. Now I'm showing you a slit picture or a slit lamp examination of the uh, of the lesion. Here you can see um, this is the slit uh, a beam and this is over here and what you want to see as the beam moves over front side to the other side you will see that this the area becomes thicker or thinner depending on where the thickness increases in this lesion over the whole area. So this is important thing. First you look at diffuse illumination, then you do a slit beam examination to see for the structure of the lesion. And here you, I'm showing you the still injectatic vessels on a higher magnification. Here you can see these vessels pretty easily over here. And here are these clear spaces which you see in these patients as well. And these are the pigmented areas as well in these patients. So this is a pretty simple case if you get it in an examination but uh, the main thing is to do give your findings and do get from history and the management is to follow up these patients. Thank you.